do subscribe to ekeda channel and press bell icon to get updates about latest engineering hsc and iit je main and advanced videos hello students today we will discuss about magnetic dipole moment if we have a magnet then we'll also find the magnetic dipole moment how will you find the dipole moment what is the formula for dipole moment of a bar magnet so first of all we'll find that next time we'll find the dipole moment for other uh, arrangements where uh, we'll consider that as a magnet so first of all we'll find the magnetic moment of a bar magnet hello students today we'll find the magnetic moment for a bar magnet let us consider a bar magnet with north pole and south pole we know that the magnetic lines of force are uh, in the outside of the magnet it is from north pole to south pole and inside the magnet it is from south pole to north pole it is a complete loop now now the dipole moment magnetic dipole moment is defined as the product of the pole strength magnitude of the pole strength because we have two poles north pole and south pole so you consider the pole strength of any one of the poles north pole or south pole multiply that with the length that is the magnetic length the length between those two poles that is north pole and south pole the distance between the north pole and south pole multiplied by the pole strength is called as magnetic dipole moment suppose this is a bar magnet and this is the axis is a line passing through the north pole and south pole this is the axis of the bar magnet and the strength of the north pole is considered plus m and the strength of the south pole is considered as minus m so that will write this is plus m and that is minus m so this is plus m and that is minus m this small m is called as magnetic pole strength its unit is ampere meter now the distance between those two fixed poles i say that from the center of uh, the two poles this distance is l and from center to the other pole is distance is l so this l plus l is 2l 2l is the distance between the two poles north pole and south pole so technically this is known as magnetic length we must also know how we find the magnetic length because if i have a magnet how to find how to locate that north pole because it is just inside the end end point and just inside the end point but where it is exactly so we use a formula this distance from here to here the actual geometry the actual length of the bar magnet is called uh, geometric length and the distance between north pole and south pole is known as magnetic length and there is a relationship between the geometric length and the magnetic length that is uh, known to us that is uh, so five times the geometric length
is six times the magnetic length. So from here uh, we find the magnetic length which is five by six times the geometric length. The geometric length can be measured using a measuring tape and multiply that with five by six that will give us the uh, magnetic length that is 2L value. So we get the value of 2L, multiply that with M, that gives us the magnetic dipole moment because uh, we want to find the magnetic moment that is nothing but the magnetic dipole moment. It means the same thing. So magnetic dipole moment capital M is the product of this pole strength into this length that is called the magnetic length. This is the formula for uh, dipole moment. Next is the unit. The unit of this M is unit of M multiplied by unit of 2L. Unit of M we have already written this ampere meter multiplied by the length it is meter. So it is ampere meter square. So the unit of dipole moment is ampere meter square. And what type of physical quantity is this? So dipole moment is a vector quantity. If it is a vector quantity, it must have both the thing that is magnitude as well as direction. The magnitude part of the m value we have already calculated m into 12 the direction is from south pole to north pole this is the direction of capital m that is the dipole moment vector is always directed from south pole to north pole inside the bar magnet so this is about your magnetic uh, dipole moment so you have to find m small m and multiply with the magnetic length so anyone when you talk about a bar magnet we talk about its uh, dipole moment basically the magnet is a uh, is measured in terms of the degree of the uh, measurement of the dipole moment higher the dipole moment stronger the magnet so if we have another arrangement where it has the ability or the property of bar magnet but then it doesn't is uh, not actually like a bar magnet then how to find the dipole moment that we'll discuss in our next video okay thank you